Sinikun coming out of the uh, the famous Sit Muay Thai gym uh, by way of Panzer Muay Thai in Bondi, Sydney, Australia, uh, being looked after by Andy, uh, Anthony Pantarino. I'll tell you what, his last few performances on Rebellion, he's earned to step up, and I know he's been wanting to fight some more experienced opponents, and he's got his wish. He has, and he's a heavy hitter. He loves it. You can see, even in some of the, uh, the the videos that we've seen online, keen to just get in there, throw down, and then have a beer afterwards. Yeah, I think he's very keen for a beer. He's been six weeks without one. Um, unfortunately, Jimmy Simon tries stands in his way, so let's see how fast he can get to the bar. Okay, gentlemen, you're both aware of the rules. Listen to my commands at all times. All right, protect yourselves at all times, all right? Touch them up. So five three-minute rounds. This one's proudly brought to you by Ladbrokes. Get online, download the app, and you can bet on the fights here tonight. So if you're looking at having a punt tonight, currently uh, Ladbrokes have got Corey Barrett at two, paying $2 versus Jimmy at $1.70. Make sure you get your bets in. If you're uh, opening up your account for the first time, use Rebellion, I believe, as the uh, passcode. Jimmy versus the broomstick. Big hands, leg kick. That's what they're known for in Sit Mon Chai. They take pride in heavy hands and low kicks. But the Greeks, oh, big take down there. Just an exchange of body shots there, but uh, a lot of pepper behind Jimmy's. Nice strong shot as we see he's leaning back from those punches from the broomstick. Not sure how many five rounders the broomstick might have had, but so to, uh, it'd be good to see how he deals with that tonight. He's been working his way steadily through the three round fights on the uh, Rebellion undercards. It'd be also good to see how Jimmy handles the five round heat of a. Uh, Western Muay Thai fight rather than you know, feeling it out in the opening rounds. Jimmy's starting to put a bit of pressure on him. Yeah, just, just a cracking leg kick there by Jimmy on Chai, but set it up with the punches, but he's, he's got his head right. He's, he's leaning in with those punches and he's putting his head right in the air. So if, uh, if the broomstick can bite into his mouth guard and run over the top, he might, um, he might catch him there. And in typical Australian fashion, the pants has gone up for Corey already. Oh, 
Cracking leg kick there. They are some big kicks from Jimmy. Beautiful right hand there. That'll give Corey some confidence too. And that's, you know, if, if it was me, I'd be trying to lure Jimmy into punching. I'm, I'm not confident with his head while he's, uh, while he's yeah, trying yeah, to punch. Yeah. We see him get a nice take down there. But if I was the broomstick, I'd be trying to get into a few oh, exchanges oh, here and um, and get Jimmy swinging and try and catch him. His chin's right up, as you can see. So Corey's favouring that body rip at the moment, too. He's got it through a few times. Yep, 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 yep. Also great to see in the corner too the, the young man they call the Beast Kid, Indigo Boyd. He's been a regular on the Rebellion shows as well. Both boys oh, no. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, don't do that. showing a bit of authority early in the clinch. All right. Chuck. A bit of dirty boxing using the head in there. Love it. Not showing any respect to the tie. Yep. Yeah. Good opening round yeah, from Chuck. Can't pull it on the lower back, all right? We have a look at the replays. A couple of good takedown there from Jimmy. He's got some power in those leg kicks as well. Good overhand there from, from Corey. And here's, here's that nice to return body shot there by Jimmy Simon Chai. He's just looking for the legs. Massive, massive cracking leg kick. Uh, So guys, we just had a bit of a butterfly floating through the through centre ring as well. That's what you get in the great outdoors here in Australia. On, Big thanks to Lad Brokes once again getting behind this one. Yeah, I think uh, I think Corey's got a lot of confidence from that first round. You know, he's, he's taken on a he's taken on a he's stepping up in opponents, but um, after the first round, he's landed some good shots of his own. Um, he's opening up strong as we see him just trying to land the overhand right there. Good to see from the Aussie. Yep. Yep. Big body shot. Right down Jump. the middle. He's going down low, trying to build that big one up at the top. Little uh, mouse building up on the left dive. Still not the broker stick. No, not all there, but very composed. I think Corey's a little bit wary of the power in the, the leg kicks as well from, from Jimmy. Every time he has a crack at that lead leg, he really loads it up. Oh. Good body rip as well. Corey as well. Yeah, yeah. He's got a bit of catching up Jump. to do. That's Corey. After getting that eight count. Very, very good composure. He's not, he's not getting crazy and just going and swinging as we see that big leg kick again by Simon Trice. Beautifully timed. Yeah, Corey, a lot of power. Corey looks like he's reaching down as, as Jimmy throws that leg kick. So it's obviously yeah. doing some yeah, damage yeah. to the lead leg. But I'm impressed the way Jump. that the Corey's come back after that knockdown. He doesn't look too phased. He's pushing the pace now.
Quick second round there for Jimmy. Beautiful right hand. Just just watch the watch the leg kick come in and just perfectly time right hand. Bang, right on the kisser. But not very phased as, as we see Corey straight up, very composed, and then he started to finish around quite strong with him. Obviously, we've got Corey down on the cards at the moment. Back in the corner, what do you expect to him coming out this third round? Now, uh, obviously, he, you know, he wasn't too phased. He got caught with that right hand. He, he got up, he, he composed himself and came back in. I'm still, I'm still, uh, I'm still in the, I'm in the corner telling him to try and engage in punches and, and look for those punches over the top. Um, Jimmy's head's way too high for my liking, but once, as we saw in that previous round, he's got a cannon in his right hand, so he's got to be very close. You good to go? Good to go. All right. Shot. Good referee, Nevin Bryant. Oh, oh, oh. 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 There we go. And what a finish of Sydney. Oh. Oh. I'll tell you what, Jimmy came in for the kill. Absolutely pounced on Corey before Corey even knew what what had hit him. An impressive performance from Jimmy Sitmon Chai at 65 kilos. Gee, boys, you take a look at the replay. Big right hand over the top. He saw blood and he just went for it. Bryce really cops a couple on the way in. There we go. Oh, wow. Beautiful right hand there. Did well to stay on his feet. And the last one, Busca. Just uh, right on the kisser, he did well. And it was all over. He got, he got caught with that right hand early second, uh, in the second round and then, you know, Jimmy smelled a bit of blood. You know, it's a great opportunity for him to, to stamp his way in the Aussie scene. So.